yes, 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 family. Chaos963 doing it to you in 3D. So groovy that I dig me. I like me some me. It took me a while to start liking me, and then I fell in love with me. and want you to fall in love with you, your own self, too. Listen, glad to have you here on Saturday doing what I, I'm going to be doing, and that's trying, that's putting this out and, and, and bringing some understanding to the, to the, to the body. Um, got a little something special for you on the day and uh, much needed, and uh, I know you'll receive it, receive it as I bring it. I, um, I, uh, okay, let me see, am I doing it? Is, yeah, we're wrong, okay. Um, late getting started, apologize, um, but I mean, ain't no need to even do that right now. Um, do what we do here on the, uh, Acknowledgement, chaos963.com, Cash App, Chaos963, PayPal, Chaos963, Twitter, Chaos963, Facebook, Chaos963, uh, Instant Messing, Chaos963HZ, all of us right down the bottom, you know what it is all about. Listen, first and foremost, let you know, day eight, man, of this fast, and I, I, way, I did the wedding yesterday, and I didn't put it off, and I'll post that now, and I hadn't even did it today. We're running around like a one-legged man in a butt-kicking contest, but I'm going to get to it for sure, for sure. Hope everybody's feeling good, man. It's it's about feeling good and and whatever it takes to 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 do that because you you got that coming. You know, I would that you prosper, be in good health, even as your soul prosper. And your soul is prospering, so be in good health, be happy. Um, and if not, then uh, get happy. Find out what you need to do to make yourself get happy and get happy. Uh, okay, listen. <laughs> Cause I'm happy, feeling good. Uh, you know, stuff try to come my way, and I've been in the battle long enough to know and understand. When I see it coming, I knocks it down. There was a book I read dealing with the devil once, a while back, long time back, and uh, it said how oftentimes we let the enemy get right up close on us, man, before we even start trying to take action. You know, and and that's not the way to be. When I when I when I get up in the morning and I feel a little ache or pain or a twinge, I go against it right then, right now. I, I I take the things that I've done in the past that I know to do to have victory today, and I and I move in that. And I'm encouraging you to do the same thing. You don't have to be sick. Nothing, nothing, man. You are supposed to create your heaven right here on earth. You create your heaven right here on earth. Said, uh, I mean, it tells us, call upon those things, speak those things into existence, call those things that are not as though they are. That's what this is about. And then to that, there's victory, man. Understand there's victory. Yeah, there's, there's a fight. It's a fight, but uh, we win. Fight's already won for us. You know, it's not even a fair fight, man. It's, it's, a, it's a football game, and they only got five guys, you know. It's a basketball game. They got two guys. They got, <laughs> yeah, I like that analogy right there. They got two guys, and we got five. We cannot lose, and we don't. We win, so let's go on and win, man. Um, man, a lot of stuff jumping off, but I don't do the politics and stuff like that, so I'm going to say all that, what I just said, and let that go. But uh, be cognizant of the things happening around you, and I say that because when you are cognizant of it, then you could take – the advantage of who you are, the spirit and the power within you, and speak against that stuff and and um, and uh, put your energy into it and, and make it a, a a victory for you. Yes, um, feeling kind of lightheaded. <laughs> yeah, but it's all good. Uh, that sad wing waiting yesterday. I was two sixty nine. So that was, uh, I don't know how many pounds it is altogether so far, but it's going to continue to roll off. Victory. Victory, victory. Three, three, three. Victory. Um, I'm going to be speaking on, on, the, on the need to, to, to come together on this stuff, you know. Uh, and when I started, you know, getting conscious and reading and understanding stuff, I, I quickly came into the understanding that, some of the reasons that we are uh, uh, 
defeated as a, as a people and have problems coming to the knowledge and, and, and spiritual understanding and whatnot is because the uh, our own people, man, get involved and caught up and they and they do stuff that's uh, that's that's detrimental to the body. When we move into this time that we moved into now, we have the opportunity to to change all that conduct. And, and I'm encouraged to tell folks, you know, if you was problematic to the body before, you got, you got a chance now to kind of straighten that out. You know, some folks even need to come around and redeem themselves for some of the madness that they've done. You know, I look at this one situation that's going on now, and I'm like, wow, man, this 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 uh, this gentleman is 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 uh, doing the body harm, and and I see it on so many levels, so many planes. And the interesting part is that a lot of folks don't uh, understand our total history, and they empower the enemy almost without knowing, but but. Everybody knows on some level, you know, your 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 conscience is going to speak to you. But a lot of folks have taken it and override their consciousness. And they do it because of the, the thing that has really got us in bondage on here that has folks in bondage is, is, is a glam spirit. You know, uh, the, 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 that's a spirit. You know, when you, folks trying to be glamorous and folks craving and, and chasing hard after that dollar, man, that's not, that's not what it's about. That's not the spirituality that, that our ancestors demonstrated. You know, we demonstrated a, a spirit of camaraderie and love and, and, and quick to help one another, you know, uh, to, to, to feed each other and to, you know, uh, the, the scripture, you know, it takes a, a village to raise a, a, a child. And those types of things gave an understanding as to the spiritual convictions that our ancestors had. And so into that, that's what we got to get back to. As this power is released to us and we have an a, a opportunity to move into the power that is being released now. The things that we have to do is one, kind of point out our uh, uh, our family that is 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 counter to the body, you know, that is not trying to uh, better strengthen, build up the body. You got to you got to pull folk up on that, man. You know, I look at a lot of these rappers, and as I'm getting more and more opportunity, I'm gonna be pulling up a whole bunch of cats. You know, I'm saying, hey, man, you cannot be singing about uh, uh, things that that put our women and, and some of the sisters now putting our men in bad uh, light and speaking ill of them because that's not that's not conducive to the building of the body. That's got to stop, man. You know? And and then, then the the other part of that, when they get paid, they get, uh, you know, uh, the, the, the feeling that they got to be this, you know, that it's, that's it. You know, that's what makes them when they get this money. You're not your money, man. That money d does not make you, you know, you can make money, but money doesn't make you. You can't let it make you. And and oftentimes, you know, the, the folks get caught up into that and it's supported by everybody around them. You know, oh man, so-and-so, he's doing good. Why? Because he's making a lot of money. Okay. Well, then you see cats, you know, that are making a lot of money and, and, and get caught up in the pitfalls of the other things that go with that life, with that glam. And, and it'll, it'll get you, you know, sooner or later. And then what's really interesting is oftentimes when you get caught up in that, the very people that help put you in them places will bring you back down. They'll bring you back down. I, I remember when I was on my sabbatical, man, it was oftentimes when there were things that, that solid dudes, you know, like myself, would not accept because I, I realized that, you know, there there's a string attached to, to that. And and you know, all of this stuff, there's strings attached to it, particularly when you're dealing with the worldly folk, you know. They they got a there's a string attached to that. There's no free lunches, no easy streets, you know. You get your back scratched, and pretty soon they, <laughs> whoo, okay, I got a little itch back here. I wonder if you can handle that for me. So it, it's a, it's imperative that we be cognizant of that, and and do what's needed to be done, not to get caught up into that, man. You know, you you are going to one day possibly regret that. And I'm speaking to you know some of these young rappers, and then some folks, you know. 
ain't got to be rapper. I see folk caught up in, in the corporate scene, man. And and when you get caught up in that, boy, it's it's uh, I seen what they'll do, man. They'll step on a baby chicken. They'll they'll throw they'll throw gasoline on the church. They'll throw a bucket of water on a drowning man. You know, we 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 are not that. You know, we've tried to become that. I speak and use the the verbiage of of, of environmental retardation. You know, and and because the environment has made us retarded, man, and trying to be like Mike. You know, that Mike over there. That that is that's not what's up. You know, we got ancestors, man, and and they came and did it right, and that's what we need to be looking at for our uh, guidance and whatnot. And speaking of ancestors, I'm gonna pour me some of this. Like basil. And uh I got okay, I just pull them up out chair, yeah. But uh let's be like let's be like us, not like Mike. Be like you. We can't we can't be uh, we can't be all that foolishness, man. Cannot be it. I'm also running this uh this um the tape where I, where I weighed in yesterday, and I'm going to weigh in right after this when I'm through today and, and put that up, man. That just, just a lot to do, and uh, and I'm going to do it. Hey. So then, having said that, I, I, I pour some libations, work with me, and and my mom, Julia Murder Low, Ashe, my dad, Wing Ashe, my grandma, Daddy Lenny Ashe, my great grandmother, Eva. Uh, Shani, I say, uh, to my Uncle Wayne, I say, my brother Dwayne, I say, and to, um, to uh, uh, Zerbandi, I say, to uh, Mother Earth, I say, to uh, Papa Legba, I say, to uh, Cristo Negro, I say, to, uh, let me see here, Santa Maria Muto, I say, to all the uh, uh, fairies and emsons. I say to uh, the spirits known and unknown, I say, family members known and unknown, I say, to your family members as you put them up, known and unknown, I say. So let it be done. It's a must, man, because they are here. You know, the word talks about the seven and twenty-four elders, et cetera, et cetera. We got folk up around us, man, that are cheering us on. And it, it's uh it's uh to our advantage to cut into that power. So let's cut into that power. Woo! Hallelujah, feeling good today. Um having said and done that, I'm gonna show you share this quick scripture. I'm I'm really gonna start sharing some other uh, uh, books too as well with you because I know that's important. But uh, I'm gonna share this here with you right right now because this um, is an interesting scripture. And it's kind of saying what I'm saying. And uh, it's just important man to to understand and, and take responsibility for what you do and realize that what you do not only just affects you, but affects others. It affects everybody, man, even whether you realize it or not. I mean, globally, you know, small thing you do. We're all connected, man, in ways that are unbelievable when you really look at it. But also, it's still an a, a individual path as well. You know, you got to work yours out, man, and, and come to your own knowledge. So I'm going to share this verse with you. I get this out of Acts 12 and 10. And uh, boom. So as it says here, uh, when they were past the first and the second war, they came unto an iron gate that leadeth unto the city, which opened them up to its own accord. And they went out and passed through one of the streets. And this is the wrong verse. Hold on, let me get it. Man. I was looking for the verses and, and, and had several verses set out in different uh, windows on the thing and then erased the other one so they wouldn't be in the way. And obviously I erased the wrong verse. But I'm going to find it right quick here. But basically it's a scripture where they were in the upper room and they came together and it, it says that they were all on one accord. 
They, they were all in unison. They were all in concert. They were all together, believing as one, moving as one. And, and into that, the power was generated. And they said and that's when the, the, the spirit came down upon them. And that's where we will be. And, and whether we understand it or not, we are moving as one accord. And so if someone is doing something that's detrimental to the body, then everybody's being harmed by that. So, again, let me see if I find it right quick. And I'm not, man. I, you know you know the verse. And if you don't, I just told it to you. So now you know it that way. But, again, the power came when they were in one accord. When they had come into agreement. And I'm not going to spend a bunch of time. No, I'm not. Oh, shoot. <laughs> okay, but anyway, you know the verse, man. And, and they were in the upper room. And um, let me try that. I answered it myself. All right. Okay, I think I got it here. Let me try this. It says in the former, and when they were coming in and they went into the upper room, where both both Peter and James, John, Andrew, Philip, Thomas, Bartholomew, and Matthew, James, and the son of Alphaeus, Simon the Zealots and Judas and the brother of Jesus. These all continued with one accord in prayer and supplication with the women, Mary and the mother of Jesus and with the, his brethren. And these days Peter stood in the midst of them and said about the numbers in the scriptures. Anyway, I'm going to let that go. It's right in there. That's Acts 1. And I shouldn't know exactly what that is. It was a time where I could take you right to it. But, uh, I haven't studied so many of the other things. But it's, it talks about how the, because of when they were on one accord, in one accord, that that's when the power demonstrated itself. And so that's what we uh, we will be, have to be, and 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 into that when we become, uh, get on that one accord, man. And even now, the, the, the power is moving. But boy, that, that, that if, imagine... Everybody on one accord in unity moving, it'd be awesome. But understand this too. There's there's going to be the, the time when when the move starts to come like this thing starts winding down, coming to an end. It's not gonna take everybody. And, and as I said once before, you know, Jesus moved and did what all he did with him and, and twelve disciples, the, the Christo spirit. But if 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 one person, you know, uh, uh, might be the one that tips the scale, the book I read called The Tipping Point, and it talks about when, when things start happening and then you get to the point where it becomes trendy or, or whatever, it's, it's when that one person gets in and tips everything towards that direction. So it's not, you know, looking for like every single individual, but there's just some, some twos and fuse coming together and there's going to be a tipping point. And when we hit it, man, this thing is going to move fast and strong. And it's moving fast and strong now. You know, we got the, almost the whole world, like I've never seen, uh, uh, protesting and, 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 and rooting and, and, and putting up the understanding that, you know, what's happening ain't going to be stood for. So, you know, that shows that the one move right there started an avalanche. So if it if, if be but one person that can be the one that, that, that breaks the camel's back, that straw, the verbal straw that breaks the camel's back. Let it be one person. But for the collective, man, we we uh we need for folks to come together. We need for folks to to, to step up in in their capacity. You know, I, I say oftentimes, you know, if you uh, got a verse, got a song, got a word, step forward, man. Not this platform, another platform. 
But in some way, you know, step forward because it might be just that very word that you share that will free some other folk, you know, from bondage or whatnot. And so you need to definitely be cognizant of that, man, and, and, and share what you have. Uh, woman, man, I don't, I don't say man and that. You understand what I'm saying? So then. Ah, excellent. So looking to come back on, on next week, I'm going to be on this format, 730, pumping it out. Um, got the other things supporting it. And so, you know, if you want to go over there, definitely would appreciate the, the support in that capacity as far as going to the to the web page. we got some ways where you can, you know, do some financial support and, uh, and, and, and get something in return as well. And the other avenues we got that you can come in and, and start boosting up. Because I got to, you know, get the old algorithms and things like that happening. So that's what I'm looking to really work on on, um, on next week. So I'm going to be pumping. I'm already started, you know, sending it out to some different folks. So what I'm saying with that, if you got somebody you know might be interested and want to hear it, let them know that we're on and doing the thing and, uh, and uh, start spreading the word. Uh, cut out, man. Um, pretty much what I had to say for today. Whoop, there it is. Appreciate folks stopping in. Um, whenever you hear this, whenever you hear it, um, there's the information. Get in touch. Get at me. And uh, and, and uh, appreciate the support. So with that having been said, I'll just uh, bid you all a farewell and uh, make it a great day. Thank you.